What's up, everybody? I'm Lauren Elizabeth. I go by that because no one can pronounce my actual last name, but it's okay. Hello, I'm Andrew Loud, not to be confused with low, which my score won't be, because it's going to be high. Hi, my name is Kristen Hancher, and I'm here to kick some American butt. Okay? And, and here's, here's your host, host Kristen Hancher! Thank you. Thank you. Not all at once. Thank you. Thank you. You're Canadian. I get it. I get it. That's right, it's time for Tap That Awesome app. The only app-based game show that you can play while still making eye contact with another human being. Today's contestants are playing for their favorite charities. Thank you guys so much for taking time off of your difficult, difficult jobs to be here today. YouTubing? Ugh. <laughs> now let's see if you guys can unravel these app-based games and win a little cash for your favorite charities. Now if you play your cards right, and Lauren, there are no cards in this game, yeah. <laughs> Fortunately, one of you can win up to $5,000 for your favorite cause. Now on our iPhone 7 Plus Plus coming. Never. There are nine apps. Each app contains three questions, and for each correct answer you give me, you will earn 25 likes. That is right, guys, likes. The only thing that matters in this life, besides, besides maybe your charities and family, specifically your mom, Lauren. Wink. Uh, you guys ready to dance? There is... No dancing in this game, Lauren. Uh, instead, there are apps, <laughs> and these apps are still downloading, so let's go with the only one that's ready, and that is Jesus or Jesus. Now, as we know, nothing comes before Kanye, not even Jesus himself. So in this game, you must determine whether each quote is from our Lord and Savior or Jesus Christ. Guess correctly, and you'll be awarded with eternal peace, and more importantly, 25 likes. Which is which? This is Jesus or Jesus. You guys ready? All right, Ready. first quote. I'm like a tree. I feed the branches of the people. Lauren. Did I do it wrong? No, you did it right. Unless you don't know, and then you did it wrong. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus is incorrect. Because it's 50-50, we're not going to let you guess now. So you know it's wrong. Jesus said that. He doesn't feed anyone. Yeah, well, he tweeted it. Oh, actually, he said it in an interview with the Daily Mirror on October 8th, 2010. Is that a reliable source, Hunter? Yeah, well, maybe. I don't know. Next quote. One day the light will shine through, and one day people will understand everything I ever did. Kristen. Jesus? Jesus Christ is Wrong, unfortunately. Jesus, oh my God. Jesus is much more profound than any of us will ever know. This is sad. Wow. He said it at England's Big Chill Festival uh, to 40,000 people. But don't worry, guys, you have one more opportunity. Just really think about this one. Last quote. So don't worry about tomorrow. Today's trouble is enough for today. Kristen. Okay, I'm gonna guess Jesus, because the other two are Jesus, so. With that logic, you can't be wrong. That is right, Jesus Christ! And Matthew, six, three, four. Kristen. <laughs> that was a kind of a tough one to start out, right? All right, gotta get up on your uh, Jesus Christ. All right, guys, you now have the only points on the board, 25 likes, okay, so you get cool. to pick the next app. Which one would you like to go with? Oh, number one. 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 Number yeah. one, we're going with number one. It looks like you've picked Facebook. I'm going to show you a series of Facebook posts detailing the plot of one of our favorite movies. The first person to guess the movie gets 25 likes. Let's see the first post. Ariel is not available to Facebook chat. Eric poked Ursula. Lauren. Uh, the Little Mermaid. The Little Mermaid is correct. Lauren is on the board. We the first one, but we're not allowed to buzz until after you're talk, done talking, so it's a little misleading. This is literally the first time you've ever let me finish a sentence. Uh, let's go on to our next one. Wade is back on Facebook and has declined an invite to join the X-Men. Post number two, Wade has left Facebook. Andrew. The X-Men? Oh, unfortunately, no, it is not the X-Men. Does anyone else oh. have a guess? Someone who declined to join I the X-Men. Who's Wade? All right. No guesses? <laughs> oh, too late. The answer was Deadpool, the most successful oh. R-rated oh. uh, comedy it. of all time. Oh, no. Well, it's I okay. Now you have something to watch. Let's go on to our <laughs> final Facebook post. Luke has been inactive for 15 years. Ray now has five new friends. Andrew. Star Wars, maybe? There's a guy named Luke in it. That is right! Oh, yeah. 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 That was my guess. That's who Ray is. It's okay. Next time you got to buzz in, Lauren. Isn't this supposed to be pop culturally cool stuff? 
This is literally the biggest thing in pop culture ever. <laughs> but it's okay, there is more likes to be given out. Uh, Andrew, you had the last correct answer. Ooh. Which app would you like to go with? Gonna go with seven. Number seven, lucky number seven. You have picked Zombify. All right, now the zombie apocalypse is coming and it's ruining all the faces of my internet famous friends. Let's hope it doesn't touch this beautiful work of art. Lauren? Yeah? It's not what your mom said. She doesn't like you. I'm actually really close friends with her mother and she's a, fa she's a fan. All right, the YouTuber. She's a fan? I just need you guys to guess the YouTuber who has become an undead nightmare, okay? Guess which YouTuber has been zombified. Look closely. Let's look at picture number one. Lauren. Alex Iono. Alex Iono is correct. 25 more likes. There we go. Is that your point dance? Yeah, sure. Yeah, I like it. All right, now let's go to picture number two. Lauren, again. Tyler Oakley. Tyler Oakley is correct. Lauren. Let's see if she can get the three for three, the final picture. Lauren. Grace Helbig. Grace Helbig is correct! Lauren, three for three, putting you in the lead with 100 likes. And again, you had the last correct answer, so you have control of the phone. Where would you like to go? Nine. Nine, nine it is. That's right, it is time for title. Now, as we know, music can be healing or it can make you want to burn every feeling to the ground. <laughs> this one puts your knowledge of the harshest breakup songs to the test. Can you guess the artist based off of their harshest breakup lyric? Okay. Guess correctly and you get 25 likes. You guys know music? Yeah. Okay, yeah. well, slow down with your enthusiasm. Let's go to the first lyric. I'm just saying you could do better. Tell me, have you heard that lately? Lauren. Taylor Swift? No. That is a common misconception about all of these breakup lyrics. Andrew, you have a guess? Uh, Drake, maybe? Drake, Marvin's oh! Room is correct. I didn't even know. Oh. I knew I knew the lyric. I just Everyone that knows that lyric. Really it's culture. sad yet so real. Let's go to the next one. I could have another you in a minute. Matter of fact, he'll be here in a minute, baby. Andrew. Beyonce. Beyonce Irreplaceable is correct. We have found our music. Ooh. Fanatic, you're doing a great job. Final lyric, three for three. Let's I see if you can do songs. it. I love sad songs. I was too strong. You were trembling. You couldn't handle the hot heat rising. Rising. Mm, baby, I'm still rising. Lauren. Katy Perry. No. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't she have a song called Rise? Roar. Does not mean that's the only song with Rise in it. Oh, Kristen, <laughs> sorry. Uh, Adele? Adele is correct. No, what? Well done. That was a guess. That was it a guess. It doesn't help that you're so tone deaf. I can't <sighs> Did you hear that sound? That means it's the end of round one. <laughs> Welcome back to Tap That Awesome App. Lauren, you have the most likes with 100 in total. Tell me a little bit about uh, your charity. I am playing for the Kind Campaign, which is one of my favorite celebs charity. Her name's Lauren Paul. She's actually the wife of Aaron Paul from Breaking Bad. But that's not important. What's important is that it's a charity based around anti-girl and girl bullying, and they go around to different schools. They have a great documentary. And I love their slogan, which is, you can sit with us. So I just love everything they're about, and I would love to give back to them. So can I sit with you next time? I guess so. Yeah, you have to say that right there. All right, Andrew, how are you? Good, how are you? Good, what charity are you playing for today? I'm playing for the World Wildlife Fund. Okay, so I want to know what your favorite animal is. Um, an elephant. You were not so sure. No, I'm sure, I'm sure, an elephant. Positive. But like maybe a baby elephant, but I guess it's the same. Well, it's only a baby for so long. True. And then, and then it I grows. All right. Oh no! All right, finally, Kristen. What charity are you playing for? So I'm playing for the National Scoliosis Foundation. And this charity is actually really near and dear to me because I had scoliosis before. And I also had the surgery for like the recovery and all that. And I know how hard it is. So I just kind of want to raise awareness for it and help the cause. Well, that's fantastic. Well, thank you guys so much for playing for your charities today. We are now moving into round two. Anybody has the opportunity to catch up because each question is now worth double the likes. So if it was worth 25 likes last round, it is now worth 50, which ironically is the age of people who don't get this show at all. <laughs> at the end of this round, whoever has the most likes will advance to our third and final round for a chance to win up to $5,000 for their charity. Now that amount could literally change someone's life or and One elephant. elephant. Yeah, we're on the same page. <laughs> All right, Lauren, you are in first place. You have control of the phone. Which app would you like to go with? Three. You're going to go with app number three. You've picked That's your specialty, Lauren. A wise man once said, he who smelt it, dealt it. 
It was my dad. I'm about to show you some inspirational quotes. You have to tell me who said them. Guess correctly and you'll get 50 likes. Inspirational quotes, tell me who said this one. First quote, honestly, everyone told me not to bring the monkey. Everybody. By the way, this is pop culture related. Johnny Depp. Ooh, not Johnny Depp, unfortunately. Andrew. One of the Kardashians from that one episode where they had a monkey. <laughs> That's as good a guess as any. Shia LaBeouf. Oh, that is very natural thing, Shia. I was just going with my gut on that one. I know. Unfortunately, the correct answer was Justin Bieber, who brought- Oh, I knew that. He brought his monkey to yeah. Germany and was not allowed to bring it back. Uh, okay, let's go on to our next quote. Stop taking pictures of yourself. Your sister's going to jail. Andrew, no. last one. No, Chris. Dude, he got it Chris. wrong, he got it wrong. Uh, that's not fair. It was Chris. Hold on one second, we're gonna go to the judges. Uh, unfortunately, we gotta go with the first answer that you gave, which was Chloe, and unfortunately, it was wrong. Uh, Warren. No, Chris so Jenner. Chris Jenner is correct. Talking, <laughs> talking to Kim Kardashian while her sister was going to jail. All right, our final quote. Miley, what's good? Andrew Nikki. again with the fast buzzer. Who is it? Nikki. Nikki Minaj is correct. Miley, what's good? Well done. Andrew, you are catching up. Kristen, nice. this is your time I know to shine. The answers. I'm just. <laughs> Hopefully, it's another music category because that yeah. seems to be your thing. Let's go uh, into the next app. Andrew, you had the last correct answer. Where would you like to go? Four. Number four. All right, Skype. Oh, this is fantastic. What is the definition of confusion? Skyping with your grandparents. See if you can figure out which YouTuber my grandma is talking about. If you guess correctly, you'll get 50 likes. Okay, guys, it is time to meet the coolest lady I know, my grandma. Yay! Come on out, grandma. Hello. Grandma. Hey. Grandma. Hi, yeah. Hunter. We're on the show, grandma. Carol, I don't think the connection is good. No, the connection's good. I can see you. Hunter, I can't see you at all, honey. I love you. Okay, turn your phone. There we oh, go. Hi, hey, Hunter. sorry. How are you? I'm so, you haven't come and seen me in so long, my feelings are very hurt. Well, Palm Springs is an awful place to live, <laughs> Grandma. Uh, it's her. Okay, well, do you want to help? I know you have some YouTubers you want to know more about. You want to know their name, right? Huh? Okay, you want to know their name? Yeah. Okay, I think you know what I'm talking about. Why don't you go ahead and uh, tell them about the YouTubers you saw and see if these YouTubers can help you out. Right, I, you know, I've been watching the YouTube a lot and uh, this one gal, she's very passionate, okay? She's very passionate about her YouTube videos. She does not sing very well and she needs a little help with her lipstick. Kristen. Miranda Sings. Miranda Sings? I don't That's know. Right. That's, That's right. her! Is that her, Grandma? Congratulations, Kristen. Do you, want to, do you have another one, Grandma? Uh, yes, no, I have another one. Now, this young man, he used to be in a boy band, but I guess boy bands don't sing or dance anymore. They are so gosh darn cute, though. Uh, <laughs> this guy, he's got a lot of tattoos, which you will regret if you ever get one of those. I'm talking to you, Hunter. <clears throat> <laughs> I believe his name rings with him. Okay, um, then that's what you should eat a little bit more of, Hunter, because you got some stick legs on you. Yeah, that's just me. Those are all the clues I got, yeah. Okay, so it's a boy band that doesn't sing or dance on YouTube. Oh, Lauren. they don't sing or dance. Right. So they're not a boy band, so it's someone from OT. What? Sam Potter. Sam Potter is correct! <laughs> the deduction! Well done. Oh. Lauren, you earned every one of those likes right there. That was well done. It was like an episode of CSI. <laughs> The You're weirdest pretty. episode of CSI you, you ever. Grandma. You're welcome. Grandma, huh? do you have one more? I do, I have one more. Uh, he's my favorite. I saw this video of a very tall, handsome guy. Grandma. He talks with a real funny accent. He sings in cars. Uh, and his name kind of sounds like a robot. I might kiss him with the open mouth. Oh, okay, Lauren. Flula. Flula is correct! Well done! Grandma, thank you! Thank you! I can't hear you! Thank you! I love you! Thank you! Come visit me in the springs! I have Your a phone just broke! <laughs> I have a pool! Grandma, everybody! Okay, no, it's time to play a fast app, apparently. We're about to play the hottest game in town known as Rapper or... Get your hands on your buzzers, guys. We're gonna get 45 seconds on the clock. I'm going to say a name, and you have to guess whether it's the name of a rapper or a type of pepper. If you are correct, we give you 50 likes. But if you're wrong, you lose 50 likes, and 
your rapper's street cred. <laughs> Think about that. You have 45 seconds on the clock starting now. Seven pot brown. Lauren. Pepper. Pepper is correct. Treat. Rapper. Pepper. Rapper. Rapper. Correct. Foot T. Rapper. Rapper. Wrong. Salt and pepper. Lauren. Rapper. Correct. Dorset Naga. Chris. Pepper. Pepper's correct. Big Jim. Andrew. Rapper. No, Rapper. Pepper. Heavy D. Kristen. Rapper. Yeah, I don't know okay. what you said. Yes, I did. Carolina Reaper. Andrew. Pe Pepper. Pepper is correct. White Bullet. Andrew. Pepper. Pepper's correct. Peter Pepper. Rapper. No, unfortunately it is no. Pepper. <laughs> Capadonna. Oh, wow. that is the end. Woo! Wow. Andrew, I'm not even kidding you. Your score went all the way down to zero and then went all the way back up. Wait, I lost points for that? Because every, did, you did you not, not listen, listen to the rules? <laughs> I guess not. Pay attention. Oh, I didn't know. All right, guys, that is the end of the round. Lauren, you are in first place. You are going to our final round. You're going to play for a chance to win up to $5,000 for your charity. Andrew, Kristen, you will each be going home with $1,000 for your charity. But one of you will be sticking around to help Lauren win $5,000 for hers. Lauren Elizabeth, you disposed of your opponents. $350 to your closest opponent was $200. Kristen, you are now here to play Yell in the Blank for a chance to win up to $5,000. For making it here to the final round, you've automatically won $2,500 for your charity. Congratulations. That is unbelievable. Thank you. The game from here on out is simple. On the phone, you see a partially filled in sentence. Blank, 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 on the blank of a blank, blank, after a blank. Okay? <laughs> All you have to do is guess the blanks. Super easy. easy. And to make it even easier for you, we're gonna give you the answers. What? Yeah, we're gonna give them to you, except you're gonna have these headphones on. I see what you did there. Yeah! Uh, you're gonna have to try and guess what words your partner is saying, speaking of partner. You need to now pick one between your two opponents. Who do you think is gonna help you more in the yell in the blank challenge? Um, I'm gonna pick Andrew because he's taller. Yay. <laughs> Should not have Sorry. any effect on the game, but. <laughs> it does, I can see him more. Okay, got it. So if there's a big crowd around him, you'll still be okay. Understood, Andrew, you will be joining us for the next game. Unfortunately, Kristen. We'll see you soon. You'll be exiting the stage. Thank well. you so much for playing. Guys, Bye, give guys. it up for Kristen. Bye. Thank you, Kristen. Bye. All right, let's get back in game mode for a second. You ready? I'm ready. You ready? Yes. Okay, remember, for every word you guess correctly, you'll oh, get so 200 nice. likes. Okay? Figure out the whole... I don't want to listen to figure you. Figure out the whole sentence, and you're going to get a cool $5,000 if you do it in less than 60 seconds. I like the sound of Even that. Even if you don't get it in 60 seconds, we'll give you an opportunity. Okay, whatever. We're going to give her an opportunity to guess the sentence. All right. All right, you understand, guys. Take your places. I'm going to play this music as loud as I physically can. Ah! Yeah, oh, so it works. It's uh, so... Just an audio check. Lauren, it's too can you hear loud. Me? Lauren, can you hear me? Lauren, can you hear anything I'm saying? I don't know what you're saying. Lauren, I, wanted to, I stole some money out I of your know. wallet. I don't know. Aren't I supposed to be listening to him? Sure, if you didn't hear what I just said, it's off my conscience. Stop! Okay, great. All right, are you ready? Yes. 60 seconds on the clock. Three. Three. Two. Two. two one. one. Go. Harry. Harry. Blows. Blows. Chunks. Chunks. Chunks? Chunks. Side. 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 Oh my gosh, she's nailing California. this. California. California. Freeway. Free falling. No, free freeway. 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 No. <laughs> freeway. Cal Harry blows chunks on the side of a California highway. Freeway. 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 Oh, yes. Only one more. Yes. 